Oh no, it's flubber time. Oh shit. <laughs> oh god. Guys, yes, weed is illegal. No, weed is cool. I only know drugs. I am drugs. Hey there folks, Takes of the Black Pants Legion here, and this is the Goon RP server. I haven't played here in a while, but well, that shouldn't stop me. Let's be a botanist. Let's just see what we get into. Randolph Checkers is now the botanist. Oh yes. Good day. A role-playing server. Yeah, Goon has one. Hasn't been around for a while. And that I mean, most people forgot it existed. Ah, yes. He's just staring at me. Good day to you as well. Indeed. I am here to botany. And to do plants good. I am certainly qualified. <laughs> <laughs> oh no. Wow, there's a bee checkers? What? That is weird. Thrilling work. Deeply so. You'll notice we've got hygiene and thirst and food. Uh, all right. It's been a while since I've seen that, but it's been a long time since I played on Goon RP. Yeah, for a long time, Goon RP had, uh, I think two people on it, and that was it. It was pretty. Pretty interesting stuff. Pretty interesting stuff indeed. Well, I'm just gonna wait for uh, a minute because someone just told me, hey, I saw you log into Space Station, I'll join you. And I said, okay, sounds fun. Anyway, could I have some of your time to ask you some questions about the station? Well, what kind of questions? There's Benson Abernathy. That's Pablo. He and I often get into trouble with chemistry. <laughs> Mr. Abernathy, this man is asking questions. Also, apparently, one of my relatives is on the station. Yeah. How do you think the station runs? Opinions on heads of staff, etc. Well, plainly, these people don't know a good time when they see it. We're here to ensure a good time. Trust me on that. Stay tuned for more. All right, so now that I've spoken with the journalist. Praise the machine. All right, that's normal. All right, we're gonna just go in here. All right, there's Benson Abernathy. Okay, buddy, we growing weed or what? Need to grow some rubber trees. Oh, all right. Yes, yes indeed. Rubber trees, but too mutated into weed. Look, I ain't judging. I used to be a QM, but now I am sentenced to work in plant land. Well, have fun. First we need rainbow melons. Okay, let's do it. First, I need a sandwich. Free range monkey sandwich, fuck yeah. I need that shit. All right, so let's see. Uh, honey? Wow. And we got chickens? Oh, isn't that nice? We got all sorts of things. All sorts of nice things. Nice, first try. Let's take a look-see with our eyes. Rubber tree plant, huh. Oh, it's the captain. Oh, he hello. That guy is weird. Anyways, check this out. I heard one of my Cousins is on board. Is that you, B Checkers? Part of the Checkers clan, I presume. When I run into someone with my same last name, I assume they're knocking me off or just weird. So let's play with it. Role play. It's that game of yes and. I could also probably help. A little beaker? Yeah, I'll fill a beaker with water. We're helping. I'm like filling tiny beakers with water. Trees like water. Who knew? All right, now I'm gonna be weird. Let's see. Well, time to play my motivational tambourine. I, I think. I wanna play my tambourine. Ah! He's screaming, yeah. Yeah. That's, that's my performance. That song was called, I have a tambourine in C sharp, uh, major. Which doesn't exist. Any requests? The same song again? Okay. Guy says, uh, keep playing music, it'll make the plants grow faster. It's about that tambourine, man. Sweet tambourine licks. Mm. 
There we go. Next part requires some stealth. All right, here we go. I'm gonna look out for an instrument that isn't a tambourine. Also the I got to pick last in the music section. When you show up last, oh my God, I'm in the med bay. All right, well, don't worry about it. We'll be fine. This was part of it, you know? Hey, this is Randolph P. Checkers, Nano Trace and Employee of the Week. I want you to know that you too may be Captain Material. That's right. It doesn't take much to be a captain. And with Nano Tracing's pathway... Shut up, me! Program, any jerk with a willingness to sign up can wear the green hat of pride. Just take my story, for example. Last week, I was in space jail for cargo-related offenses, simian manslaughter, grand theft space pod, and arson. But thanks to Nano Tracing's Pathways to Excellence program, I became a captain of my very own space station. With almost four hours of hands-on experience, I learned the intricacies of command and was given my very own space station within a week. And don't worry, they cover almost everything in over four hours of riveting PowerPoints and interpretive dance sessions. So what if you don't know what plasma is? Neither does the chief engineer, and he's probably fine. Medical? Just slap a few random patches on someone, and they're good as new. See, now you can run med bay. AI acting funny? Just repeat after me. This statement is false. And just like that, everything is fine. Sign on for the Nano Tracing Pathway to Excellence program and you can earn a place among the elite while getting a full pardon for most Class B felonies. So long as you say you're probably sorry and unlikely to reoffend within a six month period. This has been a mandatory message from Nano Tracing Human Resources by me, Randolph P. Chapter, Acting Captain, Nano Tracing Command Graduation Class of Thursday. Hey, what's up? I was just on the radio. <laughs> he said, Was that you on the radio? Uh, yes, sorry. I, uh, I get in trouble a lot. It happens. All right, let's, I, I got my pills I need. And I have a Halloween bag full of candy. So there, here, have some candy. Everybody likes candy. Score, rainbow melons, nice. Just doing spaceman stuff. Let's go get a drink while these grow. Got it. One coffee, please. I gave up whiskey, though I do miss it. Is this the detective making his own drinks? Well, that seems shitty. Hot dear detective ein Alkoholist German? I'm a drunk detective. Ah, oh, yes. Ah, more coffee. I have work to do. We're doing important botany stuff. Yes, never mind the violence. Scream away all of the pain. Free money! Yeah, I agree. All right, back to work. I mean, that's not cursed at all. Hopefully the other botanists haven't invaded our fun area. They seem pretty chill. Playing on the RP server now that there's actually people on it kind of feels like Space Station 13 used to in 2016. So for me, this is nostalgia. For you, this is probably normal, I guess. Oh, for anyone planning on going to the Space Diner, there's a drone in the bar area, B Checkers. Hey B, nice name. Don't you dare ignore me. You and I go way back. Remember when we were kids and threw bricks at cars? And now we're adults and can lift cinder blocks? What a time. We are not related, says B Checkers. Come on, it's a yes and with improv. It's always a yes and. You take that and you're like, we, do, we haven't spoken ever since you stole my dog. You know, you, you, you add to it, yes and. So if I say, ah, oh, your hair's on fire, and they're like, oh my God, help me put it out. You accept it and then move to the next thing, right? Yeah, see, Pablo's leaning in. I know he's committed some felonies, but that doesn't mean you have to disown him. He's family. I know, right? Family is life. I mean, we aren't perfect. But come on, we used to go bowling. 
all the time. Yeah, I'll have you know that Checkers saved my life when we fought to retake Haley's Comet back in the day. Man, that was some tough fighting. It turned me into a roach. This person is just not picking up on it. A doctor just flew past me. Doctors do that. Don't worry about it. Anyways, now that my cousin is too cool to pretend to be my pal anymore, I guess I'll get back to running my drug empire. I mean, botany booth. I don't understand why someone wouldn't play the yes and game. I mean, that's like, that's like improv 101, you know? Yes and. You take it. Someone's like, oh man, there's monkeys running after you and you're like, oh god, put on the roller skates, we gotta get rid of them. And you know, it's simple and dumb, but that's, that's how it works. Yes and. The magic of improv. We're just growing some stuff because Pablo has an idea. What follows will be shenanigans. Oh man. You okay? Mm -hmm. I think he's lost his mind. Hey Duff, do you have a cousin that likes to go bowling? Damn Roman. No, I have a cousin on this shift that is pretending we didn't grow up together. It kind of hurts. We used to fight with lawn darts. Oh, and there's some spaceman music. I could play the tambourine to this. Poorly. Yes! We're gonna be rich. Damn straight we are. Dance! Oh man, when I lock my legs in a cage of spandex, I dance like hell to release the madness. Dance party. Man, I'm exhausted from cutting a rug. Anyways, what's next? Oh, my thirst is 74. Oh man, I could always drink some of this water or just do a bunch of these drugs. There, I splash some on me. That's what you should always do. Ooh, a lava lamp. There we go. Those are fun to watch for a while. More potash. All right, I'll be back. Snag machine, no, I need a, no. 
You. You know what? I'll I'll just have some water. You should always drink more water. And there's the chef. Learn to throw your paper cups away, boys and girls. Don't, don't have, oh my god. It's working, he exclaims. All right. There we go. Oh man, we're having a good time. Just working in botany. I'm trying to clean up our workspace. I'm ignoring the puke. Well, maybe I should scrape some of it up. Yeah, save it for later. You never know when it might come in handy. Go see if the mechanic has a chem dispenser. All right, I can do that. Just step over the pool of vomit, the other pool of vomit. Let's run. Let's go, boys! Uh, is there a mechanic on board? Mechanic here, what do you need? I need a chem dispenser. I'm in botany. Actually, I'm standing out front. I'll just wait, I guess. A lot of lizard people here for some reason. Speaks with stars. They're following the old uh, TG lizard naming conventions, which is odd. Maybe some of them have come over. Oh man, what a day. What a day. Pardon me. Oh uh, yeah, just a little bit of radiation. Don't worry about it. Well. Yeah, we're just waiting. It's always the quick things that are most frustrating. I agree, like farts. Sometimes they aren't farts at all. I mean, you push and boom, you're not wrong. I know I'm not. Sometimes they surprise you. Seems like we have some guy pretending to be a syndicate. I'm not sure what his thing is. I don't know. Oh, good. Hey, I need a chem dispenser for science reasons. Working on it, he says. All right. Just wait here and uh, see what happens. Put in the space you want it. Use a soldering iron on it. Uh, whoops. Whoops. All right. Thanks. I just threw his paper away. I kept trying to grab the wrong thing. Some servers are different in how you grab stuff. And playing on a variety of them. Uh, sometimes I find that. Well, I'll play on one thing and then I can't do the other. I'll be like, ah, yes, I mean to throw this grenade, and then it's the wrong button. And, uh, Deltards die, but, you know, all part of the game, right? All right, so there's your soldering iron, and there's your... There, there, there you go. Security's down here, so we have to play it kind of cool. All right. Let me show you the trick with a wrench. Follow me. Can do. Sprinting points to the wrench. Yeah, grab that. Can do. All right. Use it on that. All right, did. Shenanigans. And he poured the bottle out. Okay, just botanist doing botanist things. Just botany stuff, no <laughs> big deal. I think he just got irradiated. Wow, I think he got irradiated. Just standing there. Well, he's a roach person? I think he'll be all right. I think some of our chickens have died. Good thing he's a roach, yeah. Yeah, anyways, no big deal. All right, so here we go. Step one, he says. Uh, Right. 
We're doing some real chemistry. By the way, Pablo's a chemical engineer in real life. So he knows a lot about chemistry in real life. In goon chemistry, a little bit terrifying. Oh man, that guy's on drugs. Man, he is tripping hard. He's like, mm, fine. Yeah, I'm sure. Good job, Nick Nolte. Oh boy. That's science. We are doing some bad things. You feel faintly smelly. So, where do we unleash this stuff? For science, of course. Steal me another water cooler. Okay, can do. Don't worry about it. It's all part of the plan. By that I mean, well, you'll see. We're doing stupid. Good old chemistry. Mmm, honey. Oh, gotta be careful. These guys have been eating the crazy melons. Sorry, the honey is spiked. Man, that is some nuts. Oh no, it's flubber time. Wah ha ha, he says. I think we've made flubber using rubber tree and a few other things. Made lots of honey. And you know, it helped my hunger and my thirst. I smell a little bit, but I mean, I'm working in botanies, so. Oh, flubber patch, huh? Okay. Oh my god, this is amazing. That is great! Okay. Oh man, that is so fun. That is really fun stuff. Oh, whoops. Um, yeah, alright. Oh dear. Okay, now we're... This is, uh, this is gonna be dangerous. Now we make the gas. Sounds fun! Yeah, I'm down. Whoops. Kind of bouncy stuff. Oh man, that guy on the radio station's lying about us. I'll fucking show him. Uh, let's see, radio studio. I'll fucking call him. Ooh, a call. Hello? This is Randolph Percival Checkers, botanist. Also that jerk on the radio. Uh, voice is al also me. A anyways, look, we are growing perfectly normal plants. Perfectly normal in every way. And they don't contain any sort of things that, that are bad. Yeah, so how about that? No need to yell. I can only yell. I used to be a QM. But no, I made one boo-boo, and now I do this. Anyways, I'm gonna hang up, play some banging tunes. That's it. Guys, hey, so weed is illegal. No, weed is cool. All right, doing something illegal in here. Prove it. He called sec over. Wow. Oh no, the gas. See, it's all safe. It's not drugs, it's rubber. Yeah. Oh shit. <laughs> oh god. <laughs> oh my god. Oh, I, got, I gotta stop doing that. See, this is fun. <laughs> oh man. Oh my god. See? It's safe. It's not drugs. Well, he died earlier. Radiation. Yeah, they don't care. Make more gas. Let's show it to people in the bar. This is fun. I'm gonna eat more honey. Apparently I'm rather severely injured. But I am high. <laughs> okay, this, this could kill me. I'm laughing and crying. Oh god. Don't look. Pin number incorrect. What? Well, they must have I must have changed my- Oh wait, there's free drugs in there. Oh, I'm seeing crazy made up monsters. Don't worry about it. All you gotta do is stick yourself with enough uh, band-aids and you'll be fine. For most accidents. 
If you can prevent the blood from leaving, you know, uh, you're fine. Remember, when it comes down to uh, medical problems, remember your ABCs. A bone coming through your skin is always bad. All right. Um, oh, my God. Well, we started a giant weed fire. Weed fire in the bar. Come get your weed. Botany provides. Holy shit, I'm tripping balls in Greek. I'm very high. Oh, it's shenanigans. Sweet, sweet shenanigans. You good? What the hell happened? Drugs, man. Drugs happened. He is completely stoned. I'm only mostly high. Nice. Oh, pizza. How nice of them. Oh, and ants. But, you know, I mean... Oh, that's liquor. Never mind the demons. Whoops. Sorry. We've made things a little interesting, you know. Hi there! I'm a botany man. I do botany. The one that's stammering probably did it. Well, I suppose this is the part where I go to jail. If you can catch me! Oh my god. I think I have a concussion. Oh yeah, that's too good. I, I think I'm dying. Oh God. I'm being fought by an invisible monster. I'm just gonna slowly crawl. Ah, okay, okay. That was a bit much. That one. What one? Okay, okay, yeah. You're coming with me for the meantime. Okay, that's fair. Says you wanna make it easy for me? I'd love to. He has good lawyers. I'm a great lawyer. I'm 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 a very good lawyer. I'm such a good lawyer. Oh, I'm I'm a great lawyer. Don't worry about it. Oh, he's taking the handcuffs off. This could be a mistake. Just come with me. Okay. I like holding hands. I don't know what's real and what's a hallucination. Okay. Yes, Mr. Spider, who made the rubber? What rubber? I only know drugs. I am drugs. But you have to know something about the rubber. They're burning everywhere. Why else were you there? They promised me free drugs. It's a syndicate, man. They sell the drugs on the radio station. <laughs> the radio man asks you for a song. That's code for drugs. Whoever's making the rubber, he says, is a syndicate spy who sells drugs. Wow. Yeah, that uh seems real. Very real. I agree. If I call you in later as a witness, are you willing to testify? Sure, man. I love talking. All right, you're free to go then. Thanks, man. You're cool. I wrote you a song. I think I got work to do. Hold on. I call this song In the Dark with my homie, Mr. Security Man. What do you think? Astounding. Thanks, man. Security department would like to remind you that we're just doing a job here, okay? People come onto our station all the time to cause trouble, and it's our job to stop that trouble. The chaplain go crazy, and now he's ranting about skulls and painting the walls with blood. We gotta stop that. Some jagoffs in red suits trying to blow up the station. We really gotta stop that. And sometimes we get some really weird crap on the station that we just gotta take care of. Like, uh, well, I can't legally explain to you the crap that's out there, but let's just say it's some nasty stuff. And yeah, we gotta get hands on with the time that pays us, but that's just part of the job. Just comply, and you get to go home with most of your- <laughs> He's like, that's a wrench. Stop with the pushing, and the punching, and the tripping us to try to take our stuff. Give us some rum to worry, because it would be a real shame for you to get a nightstick in the bread basket instead of the creep we was trying to subdue. We just want to sort stuff out, then everyone can go back to their dang lives and work in peace. Got it? So oh, there's Benson Abernathy. Hey, it's my friend. Anyways, back to work. Well, time to shoot more drugs in me. Just gotta put more of these on me. Now, the drugs have worn off. Is that a free gun? It's the Russian revolver. I'll take it. I want in there. Sir, I want that gun. I need it for reasons. Oh. 
Man, it is all dark and shit. I gotta use my little PDA light. Botany's not fun in the dark. Apple banana. Man, all the power's out. I can't do shit. Oh, wait, I can use the lava lamp for light. Yes. All right, so let's go. Watch out, Randolph. You're gonna face punishment for your actions. Hotboxing ain't cool. Oh, yeah, Jack Lloyd. Well, you have two L's in your name, and one of them stands for Larry. How's that? Yeah, let's see him get out of that. He's like, what? You heard me. I'm gonna come out there, and I'm gonna steal your pants. I'm gonna take them and wear them until they fit my ass and not yours. Heard something about a tree of evil. Probably real. We have something called a locked door. Oh yeah, Jack? Well, I don't believe in doors walls. I can see. Thanks to all of the drugs I did, I know truths above truths. I got something earth shattering for you, Jack. Earth shattering. Man, this station is really dark. Let me find a phone so I can call in and make it all more ominous. Looks like Flubber doesn't last very long. Hey, Cargo, I need to use your phone. Please and thank you. Do you think phones work without power, mate? Some do. Some are special. But I guess, look, I really just need to steal your shuttle to go harass the radio man. I'll trade you a song for it. One song. My best. It's a banger. Use the public ones. Wow. And you call yourselves Cargonians. Harumph. Oh, he's using the flashlight. Ah, flashlights. No like. Ah, stop. Stop with the clicking. Scram, he says. Ah. Playing a song, Randolph B. Checkers, the highest man there ever was. Well, he's mostly correct. Alright, radio station. Don't worry about it, I just hit you a little bit. Alright, there we go. Alright, now let's get the fuck out of this thing. You better open up. <laughs> Who's at the door? Guess who? It's a me. I'm just gonna sit here. Hey Abernathy, I'm on the radio station, but the guy won't let me in because I'm out here shaking his door and I called him names. Oh, hi. They put very cute in parentheses. Leave that man alone. No, I am here to be on the radio. I have a right. Ouch, my feels, my lava lamp. Jesus Christ. How dare you? This is abuse, you mutant. Good job, officer. Officer? They put cute on their name tag, and they are a three out of 10 at best. At best. All right, that's it. Yeah, okay, I'm ready. Look. No, listen, I have truths you must hear. I have seen the truth. It's so much truth. Jesus Christ, why? Help me. Mother of God. Oh. Electricity hurts. Stop both of you. I desire to grow drugs and be on the air. I have truths they must hear. Ah, uh, oh God, my liver, you have slain me. Let me, please, I must tell them the truth. Such powerful truths. You may take me, but you will never take my farts. I just need you to go home. I want to be free, free my soul. I want to get tossed in a fucking hole and drift away. Great song. Anyways, please uh, help me out here. I want to be on the radio. It's my only request before space prison. Now, all I did, oh Jesus. All I did was go out here and jiggle a door and you beat me senseless senseless with great violence now i can't breathe oh shit he says oh fuck he salutes <laughs> man the police are on us
Oh my god. Christ, why? Oh, there he is again. <laughs> Listen. Oh man, I am gonna die. This has not gone well. Listen, listen to me. Hear my words. My god, you are monsters. Listen, I came in and jiggled the door and you shot me. You bastards. All I wanted to do was be on the radio. I had a simple truth to tell. You hotboxed the station earlier. That was partially my fault. I will admit that. You asked for a gun and lit a pile of weed on fire. Well, yes and no. I didn't light the fire, but I was there. However, I was here jiggling on the door and you shot me with gun and madness followed. All I wanted to do was tell a simple truth. Yeah. That's my lava lamp. Also, one last thing. Everyone out there listening, look up. There is no ceiling! Oh yeah, they put me in the porta brig. That's how you know you did a bad. Porta brig. I suppose this is my existence now. Sitting in dirty prisoner water. Prisoner water. He's like, Randolph's lost it. And Duncan might have gone power mad. Yeah, goon station shit security ain't fucking around. Where's Checkers? Sec took him. Yes, they did. Yes, they did. Not again. Can I get out? Ooh. The Porta Brig bins. Somehow you know it will unlock in 150 seconds. Yup. I'm getting out of this. I'm getting out of here. Apparently I need medical attention. Hey! You! You! You jerk! Let me out! I have secrets! I guess I just sit here. Oh man. I'm gonna get out of here. Hey! Listen here. Right, sorry about the wait. I know, right? Hey, this is Randolph P. There's me again. Listen, I'm on the radio. That's me. For example, last week I was with Simi and Mansell, but then I was very upset. I was space station. We then all went PowerPoints and then to chief engineer and medical. Just slap her. You can run med bay. AI act like that. Everything is fine. You say you're here to a message from... See, I'm just telling this guy what's going on and he's listening, as opposed to killing me. Nice. Understandable. As weed is legal. Indeed. Well, there was a flubber incident, but that was self-imposed, you know? But listen, while I got you here, one more thing. Did you know there is no ceiling? Look up, but don't let them know you aren't watching. Just play cool, play cool. Sometimes I look up and there's this guy, right? And he's sitting there in the dark typing with a microphone. And he's all gravel voiced and weird looking. He's got a big beard. Yeah, what's with that? Just keep it on the down low. Don't tell everyone. Only some people can seem to see it. I think the radio guy, he's hiding the truth. He said he sees nothing. It means He's one of them. Also, I am blind. Jesus fuck. Anyways, thanks for the help. Dum ba ding 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 ding. Num bum bum. Yeah, but dum bum bum. Let's see. Cannabis is bad, says guy with caveman speech. All right, cool. I'm just gonna mind my own business. Yeah, ungodly, he says. Hey, buddy. Question about the uh, omniscient belief structure. Uh, what is the first prime understanding of the omniscient oath? I forget. Is it about comprehending or knowing? I mean, if he wants to lean into it, I'll play into it too. Knowly. Knowledge. Okay, thanks. Knowledge. I am tech priest from Eastern Europe. Man, this place is fucked up. Look at all this honey. Oh wow, that was boiling hot. That's fucking crazy. Just another day on Space Station 13. Oh, limbs are falling off from disease? Eh, seems about time to call it for this episode. Alright, cryo storage for me. Ta-ta for now.